uh, a pleasant afternoon to each and every one. To Mama Ayan, Mama Ayan, good afternoon to the first gen, first gen, kaway kaway po, okay? Uh, a pleasant afternoon to our guests, Miss Earth International Candidate, Miss Earth Lebanon, Miss Akar Salwa. Okay. Uh, Miss Earth Premier, Miss Senya Zarina. Ms. Valeria Ayesco. Okay, Ms. Kate Cameron. Cameron. Ms. Audrey Montan. Welcome to San Paolo Elementary School. Okay. Our smiles speak how thankful we are to be with you today to educate environmental awareness and about the five R's. Retain, retain, recycle, reuse. Ano pa yun? Reduce. Ano pa? Respect. And the zero waste. And no to plastic. Here in San Paolo, we love our planet Earth. Our school-initiated project, Basura Mo Palitan Ko. In this program, pupils exchange their garbage of cleaning materials. We have white charcoal and specialty paper out of scratch papers. Some of our instructional materials and decorations came from plastics recycled. You have seen a while ago the plastic bottles full of, uh, uh, what do you call this? Wrappers, candy wrappers. Those bundles will be used in the construction of one room building for the indigenous people in the nearby barangay. Sampana Elementary School is one of the partners of the first gen. Those are the first gen, the sponsors of the said building. Another step, we have the Grammy compost for our biodegradable waste and use them as fertilizer for our garden. Okay. The school is implementing the zero waste management. Here in our school, you will feel the scent of the highland breeze, clean and fresh. The green landscape that refreshes the soul. A true grief, gift of nature is here. So, if you this, enjoy your short stay here in our school. Make it sure that we are your partner in your advocacy. Our school children are the soldiers that guard our mother earth. So, with that, again, thank you and mabuhay. Okay, thank you, Ma'am Nene. Ayan, very good talaga mga bata sa Sampalo. We just continue listening, okay? At this point, we will hear a special number from one of the pupils of Sampalo Elementary School. Gusto nyo siya marinig? Okay, put your hands together for Anna De Mesa. Oh, oh. 
and when we become respectful, we become complete. And um, Okay. We have to respect each other because we are all the same. We are all equal and we are all we, we come to this planet to play our uh, role with a different body, with a different gender, with a different uh, different name, different color, but we are all the same, so that's why we have to respect each other and be without any ego. Peace and love. Thank you, Miss Akhar Sawa of Lebanon. You have to listen, children. Makinig kayo kasi later on, magtatawag sila from among you, magkakaroon sila ng question and answer. So, dapat makikinig. Ano? Okay, let us move on to Miss Primera. You're Russian? Big brat with you? Hello? Uh, I'm Sinia Saina. I represent uh, Crimea, Miss Art Crimea. Uh, the Pinsula of North Black Sea, the subject of Russian Federation. Crimea is uh, interesting in literature and art and Bakhtis uh, Kasarai, uh, Fontan, Alexander Sergeyevich Pushkin. I'm 
Hope for this year. And I'm here to talk to you about rethinking before carrying out any activities. I know that uh, most of you might, for example, eat um, sweets and you hold it in your hand before you realize it's on the floor. But you don't know the damage you're causing. It goes a long way in a cycle to get to the water. When you throw dirt on the floor, rain falls. It carries them and deposits them in our waters. But you have no idea. You think it ends there, like let me just throw this thing here and that's it. You have no idea when that rain falls, it carries it there. And it doesn't end there. It kills aquatic flora and fauna. Then organisms that live in the water and trees that grow in the water. That is that leaves of dirt you just threw on the floor and went. That is it killing animals and killing trees. And then it disrupts processes like provision of oxygen that is used for cell metabolism and is used for photosynthesis. Now photosynthesis is used by trees living on Earth. So it has left from the earth. That paper you threw has left from the earth, go to the water and come back to the earth globally. With that, you see that it's going to affect us directly through an indirect process. I'll urge you all to please don't litter your environment. Do not think that because you just threw that dirt down here, it's going to end there. It's going to go to the water and it's going to come back to meet you. So I'll leave this message with you. Change begins with you. Change begins with your environment. And you are your environment. Thank you.